Hey everybody, this is Not A Spring Chick, and yes, they have just picked a new pope. We're waiting to find out who it is. Oh yes, you can always tell the kids of the smoke that comes out. Anyway, behind me is, <laughs> okay, look at all the stuff that we have to go through. This is from award season, and um, okay, there's a lot of stuff to go through. Um, because see, part of it is all the stuff that we have in packages, this is stuff that we have to bring to you, whether there's new products and testing things and writing about things, and oh yeah, we've got a lot more content coming out. But meanwhile, yes, we're going to bring old Kim on with comments on the headlines of today. And it's all over for the Republicans. Oh, yeah, I mean, they're losing. Again? On, yeah, they're losing on gun <coughs> control. They're losing on, on raising taxes. They're losing on the fact that, you know, that, uh, well, actually what they're losing on is the fact that Democrats can't add and subtract. Mm -hmm. And this morning they've admitted that the, ev the evidence that they've been using for gun control hasn't been updated in the last, at least the last 20 years. Mm -hmm. They're using old statistics from a former Democratic administration to talk about how things are this way, and they're not that way. Even today, they, okay, they've changed their thing to, we think this is accurate. Mm -hmm. But they're no longer, okay, so, but they're, they're going to ram things down people's throats whether anybody wants it or not because, it, you know, I, oh, and there is no truth to the rumor that the name, the first name of the new Pope is Brock. Oh, come on. Now, that's what they just said. And they, they just think say they that? Agreed, they think they agreed on a consensus candidate, the first American Pope, mm -hmm. and that will be the first time that a Pope has ever been the head of state of another country. Mm -hmm. uh, you don't think that's the truth? Mm -hmm. Well, Flea Obama says it's the truth. He, would, would a flea lie to you? And Nigeria Islamist group says has executed seven foreign hostages. Well, yeah, they, they execute foreigners all the time, infidels. I mean, if you don't want... Okay, here, uh, uh, you know what Flea Obama says? He said, if you're a Christian, don't go to a Muslim country. Don't do business with them. When you don't do business with them, they go back to the Stone Ages. If you're in the Stone Ages, okay, all their oil does you no good if you can only ride horses because nobody will repair any equipment you have. And North Korean nuclear test war threats. Unacceptable. I know. Okay, here the problem is they got Chuck Hagel that goes over and looks like he is, uh, he is really bored with the job. At least before, Hillary Clinton would go over and shake a finger at him. And they were that you know they really didn't want to be scolded by Hillary Clinton, but Chuck Hagel, I mean they've already they already said what everybody has not been saying. Yes, we are dealing with the Taliban. Everybody in the whole known universe knows we are dealing with the Taliban. But the press is outraged by the fact that they have said that the United States has got negotiations with the Taliban. Mm -hmm. And after crash abroad, Massachusetts student strives to heal. Oh, yeah, well, I, I, I get, you know, okay, it's everything you have. Um, we put it this way, when I was young, when my family, a younger member of my family were all young, we didn't have crisis counseling. You basically called, get over it. What it is, they're trying to create a whole world full of Jews, where you bet they're and dwell on the situation for 2,000 years. Does mm -hmm. it solve the problem? No. Mm -hmm. Researchers, zombie fads, peak when society unhappy. <laughs> what in the world? They, they actually do believe they, they. Remember, Democrats do studies to show you how to handle some, that form of attack. Mm -hmm. Highway patrol, high rate of speed in Ohio crash. Yeah, they were driving in a stolen car <laughs> generally when you steal something and they're chasing you. Okay, here's the rule. My, it was back when my father was a motorcycle officer. They actually have a law in California that provides high-speed chases. Mm -hmm. You know why? Because generally they result in someone getting hurt. Like my father would say, you know, I didn't want to go chase somebody at 90 miles an hour on a motorcycle. <laughs> so, mm -hmm. you, you know, and then the guys in the patrol cars, they, okay, more than often what happens is, is that you don't hear the siren even though the sirens are there and you're driving through an intersection and you generally broadside the police car. Mm. And U.S. citing security to censor it more public record. Yeah, you know, that uh, it's just, we, you know, the more liberal you get, the more conservative everything becomes, folks. And S owner says SUV and fatal Ohio crash was stolen. Yeah, 
you know, it was stolen. They're going to keep, okay, uh, two people survived, and the two people who survived are going to go to jail because deaths, re deaths from a robbery become first degree murder. Mm -hmm. So they'll go, you know, they actually, they'll spend the rest of their lives in, in a, you know, in a detention area for people that are completely disabled. <laughs> and Judge Blocks in New York City. Um, large soda ban and Mayor Bloomberg vows fight. Oh yeah, they're, they decided to, they're, they're taking it on full steam this morning, even though the fact though that Bloomberg's are selling big drinks, uh, you can go to buy a, a big gulp, you can buy, basically the law has got all kinds, of, basically it's like the Democratic Party's health care law. It's got so many waivers in it that it makes you get a farce and the judge said and, he said that it would have to be rewritten to cover everyone, not so Go back over this way just to, okay, there. Okay. School shift from textbooks to tablets. It's just mm -hmm. ridiculous because it, 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 um, that first of all, it, it, you're, you know, you, you, reading in a tablet is not the same as reading a textbook. Because you really can't mark up the stuff in a tablet. You can in a textbook. And you don't thumb through the pages. It's just an it's entirely the different same experience. experience. Because basically, um, first of all, most tablets, uh, the things you're doing in tab tablets all have synopsis of everything. So you're never going to read the story. I said, I've got an e-reader on my, t on my tablet. I have a tablet PC, folks, which they actually do make. And um, it, it basically, why well, read the info when they give you the synopsis. You just go to synopsis, know what it says, and then you take your test. <laughs>